doing here? Surgery got canceled, so I figured you could use a hand. Oh, come in. Please. You, you must be psychic. <laughs> My super managed to get everything in, but uh, he never came back, so I, I just started to arrange yeah. things. Yeah, don't get me wrong, I'm here to help, but I had a different scenario in mind. You know, maybe hang a few pictures, play some tchotchkes. Huh. Grab the other end of the couch. What? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is turning out to be the best day. Because we got out of school early? Thank God for teacher and service. Plus, I get to spend the entire afternoon with you. I can't wait to stick my face in a giant bag of buttered popcorn. Guess what? Change of plans. We're not going to the movies? My parents had to fly out to D.C. to receive some philanthropy award. So, you know what that means. We get the whole ass ourselves. Mm, I doubt your parents would take off without sending someone to check on you. Uh, believe me, they totally trust me. <laughs> I really wanted to see the movie. So we'll catch it when it comes out on DVD? This will be so much better. I, uh, I can fire up the jacuzzi, and then we can spend the whole day in bed. It's all you ever want. I'd like to go on an actual date, you know? Go to a movie, walk in the park, go out to dinner. I'd like to have an actual conversation without feeling like it's just something to get out of the way before we have sex. Okay, where's this coming from? Wasn't it you that called me the other night all crying and freaked out because of your criminal father? And wasn't it me who dropped everything to come and get you? Even after the way you've been disrespecting me by hitting on Ethan? I didn't hit on Ethan. That was me, wasn't it? Holding you in my arms while you cried. And then we had sex. Yes. But I didn't hear you complaining. That's... I just want us to be about more than just a hookup on demand. Why are you always jerking around, huh? Hey, hey, hey! hey. I'm not going to tell you again. Let her go. There's been a lot to me, what you said to Dante there. Um, I'm not used to having anyone jump to my defense like that. Look, I'm not going to let him treat you like dirt, all right? Even if he is your son. Oh, my God. He is so, he is so angry with me. I know. I'm sorry about that. But I need you to know that I'm not uh, so blinded by this need to avenge my sister's death that I don't see how conflicted you are. I mean, you got your loyalties branched out all over the place. You, Dante, me, Sonny. We don't have to go there. Look, ignoring Sonny is not gonna make him go away, all right? Believe me, I've tried. You love him and you don't wanna see him end up in prison, I get that. But that's exactly where this is headed. You gotta know that. That Sonny's the target of a major law enforcement takedown, and your son is going to be the one to set it off, so you need to prepare yourself for what's about to happen. I understand as Claudia's autopsy results are in. Any idea if they managed to come up with anything besides the fact that she was killed with a blow to the head? Any convenient proof of who did it? Not so far. I don't, I don't get this. Why aren't we being kept in the loop? You know how bureaucracy works. Maybe, maybe the information just hasn't filtered down the chain. What if they have nothing to report? What if forensics got nothing? Do we still have a case against Sonny? Yeah, we got Sonny ripping into Claudia in public and a room full of people who heard him accuse her of putting his son in a coma. That's, that's motive. People have killed for a lot less. And we got a witness who can testify seeing Sonny come home at 3 a.m. the night Claudia died with blood on his shirt. That same shirt was found in Sonny's fireplace. Yeah, obstruction of justice, destroying evidence. Right, and it contained Claudia's blood and Sonny's DNA. And a recording of Sonny referring to Claudia's death while she was still considered officially missing. And, and let's not forget the cabin where Carly gave birth right after Claudia kidnapped her. It burned to the ground in a rainstorm. Yeah, this is all circumstantial. A neon sign pointing right at Corinthos. Any good attorney will punch holes in all of that. We need DNA evidence recovered from Claudia's body. Solid evidence that will prove without a doubt that Sonny killed her. 